One time I triggered a trap, and a second before it exploded, I escaped outside and thought I was safe. Little did I know that the timeline inside this building freezes once you leave it, so no matter how long I spent outside, that grenade was still one second away from exploding on the inside. On top of that, New Vegas saves anytime you enter a building, so I was now auto-saved right inside that building with a grenade about to explode, which eventually formed an infinite loop of dying through a grenade, loading the autosave, and dying that same grenade and over and over and over again for all of eternity going back inside all good all good yo we're tanking this dude we're not <laughs> Holy shit. i got a double kill i got everybody in the other i was approaching him and i just thought there's no way this guy's just as dumb as i am Fun fact. what's the fun fact? this video was sponsored by guacamole gamer fart 9000 Counter-Strike Global Offensive in 2022? Fucking cringe! CSGO has always been a- Why are other players so damn good? Why am I so damn bad? And what would it take for me to be a passable Counter-Strike player? I'm convinced that we need to go back to using muskets and cannons for home defense after recently becoming a first-time gun owner. Welcome to Halo Reach. Welcome to Halo Reach. What. The. So I was checking my mailbox for a pipe bomb recently when it dawned on me, remember when England built that wiener dog tent? Nah, we don't roll like that anymore. We're on some new shit called Blitzkrieg. Earth Defense Force 4 is a Japanese recreation of me finding a spider in my shower. While he's learning a valuable lesson about trespassing on private property, I'm gonna remind you that this is your first and only warning that there are giant spiders in this video. Oh god, 10 second sponsor before this bomb explodes. Gamer Sims. Buy my energy drink, Guacamole Gamer Fart 9000, and use code BADGER for 10% off. It's got caffeine, it's got vitamins, it's got minerals. Hello, m Welcome back to another great edition. Ah! Fisher isn't somebody that busts a door down and blows shit up. Repeatedly getting your head blown off may not sound like fun, but I learned more in those five hours of competitive than I did in 70 hours of casual. Ah! I really thought we landed there, bro. The wheels hit the ground. Here's my experience with Halo Reach. Everyone dies. Game over. Of course you can choose brawn over brain. I don't know why the fellas don't find the Halo mechanic of just punching something over and over until it explodes as funny as I do, but I will do it myself. Silence, Brian! Like, imagine my dumbass squad showing up in the middle of a pivotal fight scene. We would literally start rounds off by blowing ourselves up with grenades just to test out if the server was hacked or not, which was pretty fun the first few times. This story starts with Big Team Battle, Halo Infinite's 12v12 game mode where I was getting stuck. Stomped. I felt like 90% of the time I was getting shit stomped by all the players that monopolize the power weapons by knowing when and where they spawn. Sniper, spree. I was able to get all that shit done and still make this video a reality thanks to World of Tanks. I am just blown away by their support. Good. That's one less loose end. And that's the story of how we turned Halo Infinite into a degenerate Halo Gulag. Zwei, eins. In hell, if this squad doesn't interest you, then hit up real life humans in multiplayer. Welcome to New Vegas, a wonderful place that makes you fuck the NCO. <clears throat> I knew I wanted it to either be a shark suit or a croc suit due to my fascination with animals that are old as fuck. The world's first gaming web browser that's so awesome, it makes me want to explore. Specialists are a thing now. Oh man, I said the specialists were called. Call the fucking cops. Don't move a muscle. All right, drop down. This video is sponsored by Tab G. No, not in the dropping a pallet of money on me type way. In the I'm officially in the video game type way. Swouse. That is actually my voice. And that is actually my skin. Pickle. But I'll tell you about it later, alligator. This video is sponsored by World of Tanks. I will allow a round of applause for the World of Tanks people for just being kick-ass. Your support is insane, and next month is going to be a blast. Thank you so much for sponsoring this video. You never need to reload because your weapon just keeps on firing. Firing, 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 firing. Which doesn't sound that busted, but when you think about it, it's busted as shit. Explain yourself. Tell me why you think 2042 is good. Tell me if it really makes you feel like Spider- Just give it some thought. What? 
Give it some thought. That's your call to action? Fuck you, Spider-Man. How did you even get- Just tell them you like money. You make money if they buy it, right? Of course I make money if they buy it. You think I wouldn't monetize this? I'm more capitalist than Mr. Crap. Then tell them it's about money. It's not a big deal. Look, look, look. Hey, everybody, this guy likes making money. See, nobody cares. It's not always about the money, Spider-Man. I just wanted the word swouse in a video game. Can it be both?